But any organism dense enough to survive three billion electron so, volts. This is where J. J. Thompson discovered the electron. It's uh, when two atoms share both. Are you sure you want electric and electron in the same sense? The electrons could travel the wormhole. Weeks ago, an electron spin Dude, detector. The friction of two like objects causes the transfer of electrons. In a vacuum, bombarded by electrons, it shouldn't even be alive. Where are the electrons? Ones and zeros, little bits of data. It's all just electron people apart. That's true enough. But any organism dense enough to survive three billion electron volts would have to be made of solid nuclear material. So, this is where J. J. Thompson discovered the electron and where Rutherford split. The they say about a co covalent bond in this school. They say it's uh, when two atoms share both their electrons, it uh, helps them to stick together. I, I could need of the Tidmouth electron is nothing short of electric. Are you sure you want electric and electron in the same sentence? Oh, give over. It's nothing short of electric. Their flaw, and where my theory differs, the electrons could travel the wormhole, but they arrive on a different plane of existence. That's what it seems. Two weeks ago, an electron spin detector at Los Alamos was observing a particle for an unrelated project. Create static electricity. You're fucking kidding me, right? Dude, the friction of two like objects causes the transfer of electrons. Science one Probably. In a vacuum? Bombarded by electrons? It shouldn't even be alive. That's what I wanted to tell you. The growth program should burn. It isn't run by weapons anymore, or energy, or money. It's run by little ones and zeros, little bits of data. It's all just electrons. I don't care. I don't know silicon's classification. Silicon's classification is semi-metallic, and its electron configuration is Ne3. The quantum computer. Mm -hmm. Electrons floating on superfluid helium. The nanotech doesn't exist to make that into a circuit. I assume the unit to change in the history of science. One of these is the unit charge of an electron. In an experiment, I have just field which fills all of space and which gives particles like the electron mass and allowed them to get caught in atoms. 